This is an instructional video for downloading and installing the Google Earth plugin and viewing your interactive Hail Express. First, we'll have to log on to the website using your username and password. Once you've logged on, click the Hail link on the right side of the page. From there, you'll have more options about our Hail products. Click the Go to Interactive Hail Express link. First, you'll need to download and install the Google Earth plugin if you don't already have it on your computer. So, click the Download the Google Earth plugin button on your screen. When prompted, click Run. It will again prompt you to click Run. The Google Earth plugin is a fairly large program, however, once it's downloaded and installed, you won't have to do this again. For this demonstration purpose, we're using Internet Explorer 8, and it should be fairly similar for Internet Explorer 7. Once the Google Earth plugin is done downloading and installing, you may have to change some settings in order for it to run. You'll be prompted for those at the top of your screen. When you mouse over this yellow bar, you'll need to click on it once and tell it to run add-on or run add-on all websites. This is the option that I would recommend choosing. You will want to run the ActiveX control, so click Run. Once you've done this, the page will reload and the Google Earth plugin should be functional. You'll know it's working if you can grab the globe, spin it around, or zoom in. Once you've done this and know it's working, you can then choose a date on the calendar for which you'd like to view your Hail Express data. Let's look at March 12th. The Google Earth plugin will then open as a full screen and you can zoom in using the controls on the right side of your monitor or you can double click to zoom in or right click, double click to zoom out. You can also click on Hail Reports to learn more information about them, like the size and location, and any comments concerning that Hail Report. If you'd like to change the date, you can either navigate using the calendar. The single arrow will go back one month. The double arrow will go back a full year. Same with the forward arrows. Or you can also just choose a, uh, a particular month and year and click Submit, and then you can view any hail data from that particular date. It'll take just a second to load. You can also click the Globe button if you'd like to zoom all the way out. This concludes our instructional video on downloading and installing the Google Earth plugin for viewing Hail Express. If you have any questions or need any additional assistance, please call us at 888-255-7099.